Good morning. This is a message from This is a message from Australia. Australia, Australia, Australia. Good morning. Well, good evening now. So, um, what I want to say is this. You're absolutely right. The United States goes around the world and screws every place they go to. I never said we didn't. I never once said we didn't. I never once said the United States of America is not the reason why the jobs are not in America. I said the power elite. What I mean by the power elite is the companies that strip the lands in other countries, the, the, the people who benefit. The American people themselves do not benefit from any of the things that you mentioned. I don't benefit from it. I can't even qualify for medical. So when you sent money over here, you wouldn't send the money over here for me to have any medical. Let me explain one more thing to you. I've already said millions of times and millions of times you blame the American corporate system for the jobs leaving America. I never once blamed any one white devil. I blame the corporation of white devils who put their own people out of work and then put a black face on it and say, this black guy stole your job. I talk about shit like that and the Mexicans stealing jobs and da-da-da-da. You're right. 
No one is stealing a job when the companies in America are sending the jobs overseas to create slave labor in somebody else's community. I said it. You said it. And it's the truth. I never once said that anything like what you said. I always, if you watch the older videos, I said everything you said, but I never once denounced America like that. America does do a lot of bad shit around the world, and I'm the first person to say it. I'm not all hoopla. I feel bad about some of the things we did. But are we responsible for your friend working in the shitty sweatshop? Yeah. I said it. Yeah, we are. But she is also responsible, or he's also responsible too. Then the economic system there, the educational system in that country is also responsible. So as far as your black South African friend goes, you ask him, does he think black South Africans have been treated fairly during the course of his life? Don't worry about anything else I said. You ask him if he's been treated equally during the course of his life. Because I can go get a bunch of Kenyans to sit right here in front of this camera with me. Kenya. It's not too far, right? Kenya's in Africa. Africa's one continent. We can go state by state, small country by small country. United States of America is no different than Africa. We have 50 some odd states, 53 states. Each state is a country when it's in its own. But we call ourselves united. The Union of America is pretty much just like Africa. Each different country. America is not one country. It's 50 some countries with several affiliates. That's how we do it. That's how it's been done. That's the way it was designed. See, Africa if it was one nation, it would be the USA, United States of Africa, or UCA, United Countries of Africa. And if they were under one president, one ruler, it'd be different in Africa. But let me say something else to you. Australia. I do feel bad for the atrocities placed upon other people by America, but they're not my fault. I, as a black person don't benefit from it. You tell me I'm wearing a sweatshirt I think it's a I don't know what it is. I'm pretty sure it was made out of sweatshops somewhere in China. America buys all this shit from China because America doesn't make anything anymore. Because the rich people want us to consume shit. If you're consuming shit, you're not building it. You're buying it. Our whole purpose here in America is to consume. See what I'm saying? We don't build anything anymore. We don't do anything anymore. We consume. We don't have jobs, but we spend money. You figure it out. I know I can't help you or change your mind. I know I've said some things that probably hurt your feelings. Not all white people are evil. The power elite is. The five people that run the planet are completely corrupt, corrupt and evil. That's what I said. The five people who run the planet don't have the people in mind. There isn't a Japanese up there. There isn't an Australian on the board. There isn't a black on the board. These people have been in power for thousands of years. They made it that way. And if you don't believe me, I can't make you believe. But there's one group of people that have been running the whole ball of wax for a long time time. Everyone on the planet who has a job pay these people. You spend $10 today, about $8 is going to be split up between these five people. That's every day, every human being on the planet who can spend a dollar or a nickel is split between these five people. It's five families. So, if there's any evil anywhere, it starts there and it ends here. That's how it works. I'm not mad at nobody. Not one white person I'm mad at. I'm mad at those that have allowed themselves to be enslaved. And if you can sit back and watch a group of people be enslaved, then you've already been enslaved. That's what my whole point is. That's what my whole new focus is. Now, if everything is toe up, if America is out there creating sweatshops overseas, I'm sorry, but I don't own one. 